Hi guys, it's Stacy, and I just have a really quick project share for you today. I created two cards about a week ago and have not had a chance to actually um, share the video with you guys. So I have a couple minutes this morning. So I just wanna share with you guys what I created. Just a couple quick cards. So this is the first one. And I absolutely love it. I think it's so cute. So what I did here was I wanted to make a smaller card. So I just made a regular um, A4 or A2, I can't remember. <laughs> just a regular sized card with the eight and a half by 11 sheet of paper cut in half and folded. So um, that was fun. I haven't made um, a smaller card in a long time. I've been addicted to the corrugated cards from Michaels. So um, I'm trying to wean myself off of those so here is this one and i used my charlotte chic um stamp which i love 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 her and i'm still working on my coloring so i have the prismacolor pencils and i am loving them so still trying to figure out paper the kind of paper i should buy and things like that but you know so far I, I am I'm having fun and I'm and I think she looks really cute I love that flower in her hair and I just love this stamp it's it reminds me of me um, we have the same hair so <laughs> I love it so okay so basically I just used um, two sheets of paper in the back um, let's see if I can there's a plain piece of pink it's a kind of pink and whitish paper that I um, put in the back. I distressed the ends, as you can see. Then I layered it with um, this cute pink, black and pink triangle kind of pattern. And then I used my punch to um, make that border. And then I colored up my image, made her nice and pink and blue. And then, let's see, I cut her out with one of my Spellbinder dies. Okay, I can't remember which one. Sorry, oh, I'm not prepared. Um, but um, if you if you want to know, you could um, message me and I will look it up and let you know. And then that embellishment, that sticker embellishment right there that says, hello. I love those. I received those from Elise. Thanks, Elise. I'm going to use all of them. I think there were five in a pack. But um, anyway, so there she is. I love this card. I, um, I'm i going to give this one to a friend. I'm trying to not shake. Um, the inside is plain. I did not um, decorate the inside as of yet. I'm not sure if I am because I may want to write a really long note, so not sure. So that's that one. And here is my other one. Oh, my finger. I have got to get the hang of this iPhone. Okay. Here's the other one. I love this one as well. Very, very, very cute. And of course, I had to use the corrugated card. Like I said, I'm trying to get away from these, but they're so cute. I, I just love how big they are. So <laughs> go figure. But this one, let's see. I use some blues and pink. So um, plain blue card stock in the back. Then layered it with um, this, I'm going to say blue and purple. I don't know. I see purple in there somewhere or I'm making that up. Maybe a very light, light lilac maybe. I don't know. But I like that pattern. So I matched it up. And then, I've, of course, I put some pink in there. I ran this strip in the background through an embossing folder. I think it's called the swirls. Um, and then I actually used... Um, the corner chomper and um, this was one of the patterns that was on the chomper and then I just laid her on um, a circle spellbinder a scallop circle spellbinders and then I just put some stickles around there around all of the um, scallops so this is my image I'm not sure what her name is because I received this one um, in a rack so I'm not sure what her name is so um, she had a skeleton on her shirt, which I didn't think went with my spring theme. So I just, um, cut out 
a tiny little circle from the pattern paper right there and put it in the middle. And I need to put some glossy accents on it, but I cannot find my glossy accent. So until then, she will stay plain. <laughs> and let's see, behind I put some lace. I don't know if you can see that. There we go. I just put some lace all the way down. You can't see it. Well, you can kind of see it down there. And then some bling right there. And then I just put some flowers right there. Really pretty flower cluster right there. Um, pinks and purples and yellows. I love the yellow. It brings out the spring. And I put some stickles. And this, where is my finger? Right. This right here. I love this flower. I love this flower. I got that one from... Elise and Elise, I love those flowers. I don't know, they're so cute. And then these purple sprays right here. And then I just have a stamped image which says, Thinking of You Today. And I keep putting some tape on there to tape that down, but it keeps popping up. And I don't know why, because I'm using some strong tape. So, okay, let's see. And I colored her up. I'm like I said, I'm working on it. Um, I gave her a little bit too much blush, but that's okay. Gave her some glitter um, eyeliner right there. Gave her some pearl earrings, her little pink shoes. I love it. And I love her little flower. I'm into flowers. So in the summer, in the spring, actually, I start wearing flowers in my hair. So, um, yeah. <laughs> so I had to put a flower on her hair. So there is my card share, guys. The two cards that I created. I hope you like them. I am having a lot of fun coloring, practicing coloring. <laughs> and um, yeah, so um, let me know what you think and I will see you at the next video. Bye guys.